Okay, welcome to Tis the Season, Season 4, Fa La 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 Feud. Why don't we get to know our contestants? Who do we have over here? I'm Mr. Campbell with Team Delirious. I'm Nate. I'm Hunter. I'm Jacob. And over here we have... Senor Sorella with Los Reyes Magos. Gianna. I'm Lydia. I'm Mia. All right, well, should we get this game started? Let's go. Let's go. All right, let's bring it in. Let's bring it in. All right, here we go. Are we ready? 100 EHS students were surveyed. Name a place that's filled with people who don't want to be there. Class. Class. Is class there? It is. All right, they're going with school. All right, so now, wait, wait, wait. They get, if you can pick it. The number one, you will steal this round from them. Name a place that's filled with people who don't want to be there. Don't want to be there. The, uh, the mall. The mall. <laughs> <laughs> the mall. Good answer. All right. Good so answer. it is yours. We'll go down the line over here. That's All right. Me. I can just slide down. Yeah. Yep. So here we go. <clears throat> Name a place that's filled with people who don't want to be there. Detention. Detention. Is detention up there? All right, that is one strike on them. Here we go. All right, name a place that's filled with people who don't want to be there. Prison. 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 Let's see that's there. It is. Ooh. All right. All right. Here we go. Name a place that's filled with people who don't want to be there. School assembly. School assembly. School assembly. That's two oh, strikes. Right. Start thinking right. ahead. You guys might be able to steal. Start thinking ahead. Here we go. Name a place that's filled with people who don't want to be there. Hospital. A hospital. That is there. Okay. Right. Here we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. All right. Here we go. Name a place that's filled with people who don't want to be there. Doctor's office. Doctor's office. All right, so we're heading over here. Let's see if they can steal the points. So what are we going with? A place that's filled with people who don't want to be there. <laughs> Go ahead. A meeting. A meeting. That is correct. They steal the points. Slide it on over. Let's see what they missed. What was the number four option? A cemetery. A cemetery. <laughs> oh. 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 Okay, all right. Well, let's bring up the next people. Here we go for the second one. Come on down. Here we go. Name something in your refrigerator that you should thank a cow for. Okay, I believe the buzzer is in over here first. Milk. Milk. All right. All right. <laughs> Okay. All right. Milk is correct. All right. So, uh, are we are up to you to start. Here we go. Name something in your refrigerator that you should thank a cow for. Cheese. Is cheese? Good answer. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. All right. Here we go. Name something in your refrigerator that you should thank a cow for. Meat. Meat. Yeah. Is meat up Good there? Good answer. Yes. yes. All right. Name something in your refrigerator that you should thank a cow for. Yogurt. Yogurt. <coughs> Is Good yogurt answer. up there? Oh. Okay. Here we go. Name something in your refrigerator that you should thank a cow for. Butter. Ew. Good Is answer. butter up there? That's yeah. Yeah. They literally stole all right. them around. Congrats nice to them. Guys. Slide yeah. those points yeah. over. All right. Way to go. Wow. Taking them in the lead currently by 10. All right. Let's get two new people all out here. Let's see what we got. Don't be afraid to raise Okay. 100 Chuck E. Cheese employees were polled. Name something you do if your date took you to Chuck E. Cheese. Eat pizza. Eat pizza. That is yeah. up there. Wait, wait, wait. Now you, you still you could, oh. you could steal, right? Can you name something you do if your date took you to Chuck E. Cheese? Uh, play. Play. <laughs> play. <laughs> it's yeah. there. 
Okay. All right. Okay. 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 All right. So it's theirs. What? Name something you do if your day took you to Chuck E. Cheese. Leave. <laughs> Leave. <laughs> Leave. No. It's it. <laughs> Leave. All right. Here we go. Name something you do if your day took you to Chuck E. Cheese. Listen to music. A show, a show. Listen to music, a show. Uh, all right. Name something you do if your date took you to Chuck E. Cheese. Dance. Dance at Chuck E. Cheese. Oh, uh, close, so close. All right. Name something you do if your date took you to Chuck E. Cheese. Throw up. Throw up. Throw up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right, this is it. Coming over here to steal. Name something you do if your date took you to Chuck E. Cheese. Well, Mr. Marzak, if my date, my wife, took me to Chuck E. Cheese, I think we might break up. You think you might break up? <laughs> Let's see that's up there. Yeah! yeah. yeah. That is correct. Slide those points over. All right, let's see what we missed. What was number five? Last. Ah. All right, well, let's do the next one. All right, let's go. All right. For this one, I decided to pull 100 retired pilots. Which of these seven dwarfs describes how you feel after a long day of school? Is sleepy up there. It is. <laughs> All right. Angry. Angry. Is angry up there? <laughs> we'll never know. Uh, no, oh, no, 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 it's not. So oh, we're back over this team. Here we go. Which of the seven doors describes how you feel after a long day of school? Exhausted. <laughs> oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Exhausted! <laughs> Exhausted! <laughs> Exhausted! Yeah, no, it's a new door. Uh, uh, it's a new, <laughs> it's a new one. one. Alright, so no, I don't think that's up there, so I'll head down Dopey. to... <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think Dopey was one. Alright, you're up. Grumpy? It's Grumpy Air. Right. It is. Okay, they're still alive. Uh, is Dopey there? It is. Oh, yeah. Doc. <laughs> Doc. <laughs> All right, that was only right. two, so this is it. They have one more. Start thinking ahead. All right. Yeah, it's... Uh, just do it. Just do it. Bashful. We'll go bashful. They're going bashful. <laughs> it's there. Okay, there's only oh, one there's more, but they only have it? one more X. Just happy. They're going happy with confidence. <laughs> and yeah. Yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah, exhausted. Yeah, definitely. Okay. All right. So, <laughs> exhausted is not a dwarf, no. Uh, but this is going to be tight. We have one more round, and the scores are basically tied. So whoever gets this is going to be it. So let's bring it down. Here we go. Here we go. Are we ready? This is it. 100 WWE wrestlers were polled. Name a weather condition that would be a good name for a wrestler. Stormy. Stormy. Stormy is there. Okay. okay. Name a weather condition that would be a good name for a wrestler. I guess the same thing. <laughs> lightning. Lightning. Is lightning up there? Uh, All right. All right. There's. Okay. All right. Start thinking ahead. Here we go. So, all right. We are back to you. Name a weather condition that would be a good name for a wrestler. I'm going to go with thunder. He's going with thunder. It is oh, there. Is right. <laughs> All right, here we go. Name a weather condition that would be a good name for a wrestler. Uh, ice. Ice. Oh, is ice there? Oh. All right, that's their first strike. 
We're gonna go with uh, Hurricane. 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 Nice. Nice. Like Hurricane is there. All right. All right. Here we go. And name a weather condition that would be a good name for a wrestler. Tornado. Tornado <laughs> is tornado up there. Yeah. Oh. There All right. Okay, it's that last one. They get this. They are basically going to win. So what are we going with? Tsunami. Ooh, They're like going with one. Tsunami. Is Tsunami up there? Good answer. Nice one. Yes. 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 up there. Slide so those points point. on over. Yeah. All right, there's a score. It looks like the Delirious has moved on with the rest of knowledge. Yeah, well, congrats to both teams. Congrats to both teams, and we will see you on the next episode. I like that exhaustive. <laughs>